it is 352 on Wednesday, which means we are live in the 352. I am Sandy Moore. I'm the Executive Director of the Leesburg Area Chamber of Commerce. And this is a program that we do for our members to highlight them and spotlight them so that you can get to know our businesses a little bit better. And today, I am in the very beautiful Victorious Antique Warehouse. And we are going to talk to Vicki Murphy in just one second. Hi, Vicki. Hi, how are you? Welcome. Well, Vicki, tell, um, tell us a little bit about your place to start with. Well, it's a, an antique store, and we um, have antiques that we import from France and Belgium. I go over there and buy them. And we also make furniture that blends with antiques and looks old. And sometimes we even take old pieces and make them into something else uh, because people want to do today's work and needs for them, and old pieces don't always do that. So we remake them for them. So cool. Now, how did you get started doing this with the antiques? I've just always liked antiques. My mom used to refinish furniture out on our side porch, <laughs> and I always liked watching her and helping her. And I just have, I've always liked it, and it was, I, it's just, I think it's better looking than new stuff. So I just love it. I've always have. Well, and, and I mean, and you have, I mean, well, one, you just have, uh, every time I'm in here, I'm just like, it's, I'm blown away with how pretty it is and just how everything looks. Um, but tell me a little bit about where you get these antiques. And I know we're going to get to see the back of the warehouse in just a little while. Everybody loves the back. Yes. Um, I go to France and Belgium a couple of times a year, and I buy pieces there. Um, I have people that I deal with over there now all the time. So, and they'll save pieces for me. They'll send me pictures of things, and I'll say yes or no. And, and they'll save them until I'm over there, and then we send a container. They pack the container, it comes in a ship, and then the ship comes into Savannah, and from Savannah, a truck brings it down, and we unload it. Okay, so a lot In two of, hours. In two hours. <laughs> yeah, it's not easy. <laughs> so show me some of your favorite things that we have in the storefront. I know that there's a lot of stuff that's oh, your favorite. everything, pretty much. Everything is your yeah, favorite. Like so tell everything. me a little bit about a few of the things in here, and then let's walk in the back. Well, we have, we sell a lot of these buffets. This is one... Um, we paint the base and, re and redo it, and I love this one especially because it's got those big long hinges on it that are absolutely fabulous. And we redo the top, and we, um, they were, they're a lighter color, but we stain them darker because it looks better with today's you know, things. And the lamps that are on it, those lamps are hand done. They're made from old iron, um, and we have a guy that makes them for us, and he does a spectacular job. They're gorgeous, and we sell quite a few of those. Um, we have, Look at all the, and you have all these chandeliers, very yes. pretty, I'm just and putting them out. The chandeliers have been all rewired. This is a um, Henry II buffet, it's also from France, and we painted it, we left the top natural. Um, actually the top on this was warped and we made a new oak top for it. So we did that. This is a table. Well, and let me, let me just, because you said that, um, so you did a new, so, so you can take things that are old that maybe need a little something new and you can redo yes. it. Yes. So that oak part is new. Yes, we do a lot of little something new on a lot of things. <laughs> <laughs> um, so this is, uh, our, the fir actually this is the first round table we've ever made. The base, there were two of these bases. Um, they were on a table that I bought and when it got here I didn't like it. So I, the top was not good. I didn't like the top. So we took the bases off and used them and we made a round table. And this is a five foot round and it's 60 inches and it's um, old heart pine, reclaimed heart pine. So we do that. And then this is a cabinet. By the way, Miss Kitty is here from yes. the Lattice. Oh yeah, she comes every day. Um, oh, this, this is, is a cute cabinet. cabinet. This was an old door and we made it from an old door, we made the cabinet and these are old hinges from um, St. Louis. Okay. And they were in Victorian houses there. They're really, they're very, very cool. This was an old um, black, back plate, and this is an old doorknob. So you re so the whole cabinet is made out of a door. But it, it's made from a door, and then it has shelves inside. It's great. It's a fantastic pantry, or linen closet, or bathroom cabinet, or toy storage for kids. Just, you know. Lots of different uses lots you of, could use lots for that. Of uses. And so pretty, I mean, just beautiful. Thank you. All right, well, take us to the back. Okay. I know you could keep going here. Well, yeah. If you see anything on the way you want to point out, well, you're welcome. Yeah, well, this, was a, <laughs> this table, this coffee table was made from a Henry II table. 
and there's all those tables are generally really short you can't get your knees under them so we just shorten it up enough to make it a coffee table oh. it's got an oak top that which is the original top this is a kitchen island that we make this is one we have some that we do out of the ceilings of old buildings I get the cabinet shop to make the guts for it and then we cover it and it has an old heart pine top so you get the drawer the drawer, it's all nice just like your kitchen cabinets inside oh yeah and it's they're great we sell quite a few of these these the, um, they're awesome and we can do any size any design because they're all they're cooktops in them you can oh Old. Old. And people who have antiques in their home or want something that's more unique, they love these even that they made a kitchen island out of and it has more character. It gives them a little more, it gets something, yeah, no. well most of this is all new, right? except for the top, but oh, we've yeah. been here for 17 years. So people who move and come back they get another one because they had to sell the one they had with their house <laughs> well yeah because that probably was a good selling yes. point yes I think the one most overwhelming thing that I ever hear from people that come to sell them with their house and then they have to come back and buy something similar because they love them so much. <laughs> That's a good thing. It is. I like it when they do that. <laughs> so like, this yeah. is a. Uh... All right. This is the warehouse. The warehouse is about five thousand square feet, and it we keep all the pieces back here that we haven't done anything to yet. We can pick their piece out, and then we can do whatever they'd like with it, or they can buy it at. Is it coming through? Okay. All right. Well, we're having technical difficulties. I'm sorry we can't show you the back of the warehouse because that's really cool. But tell us, so tell us a little bit about that. And maybe I'll see if I can just peek through the window while you tell me. Okay. So in the warehouse, we have all the furniture that, and parts and pieces of furniture. We have doors. We have all kinds of things that we use for building and, and everything back there. And then that's, we have a workshop there and I have a builder who is Jason. Joshua does my finishing as well as Chrissy. They're the two finishers and painters, and they're both really, really good. I mean, really good. At what well, and I've seen the work. And, and you know, the chamber, for example, we got a great table that, that we used table. for the con our conference table. And the, I think the legs were original, just absolutely gorgeous. Mm -hmm. And then you all did a, a beautiful top to it. Yes. As well. And we got a couple desks also for the yes, chamber. That's true. That's right. That's right. They're Danielle's good. beautiful desk, my beautiful desk, <laughs> <laughs> all came from here. Um, so, so you do. We know we, you do really good work. So, what else is there? Anything else that you can tell us about Victoria's? I'm sorry we didn't get to show that's the back. Okay. I'm, I'm saying that to everybody else because it really is very cool. Yeah. So, you know what? They just need to come here and check it out. They can. You're welcome. Everybody's welcome in the back. Um, we have some old iron back there. There's old windows and doors. Uh, as well as pieces of furniture and you can custom do your own piece and we do custom you know, anything entertainment centers we do we do um, tables farm tables we have old legs we can get new legs we have heart pine tops if you want a painted top we can do that I mean we just pretty much anything you can think of we can pretty much do so I know you mentioned that you all can do like if they if they have stuff back there and they want to use it in a piece yes and, but they also can 
even get it raw in the raw state sure. and work it on, on them for oh, themselves. We sell, yes, right now we're having a really big sale because I'm getting another container in. So if somebody wants to buy their own piece and do it themselves, woohoo! I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm very happy for that. <laughs> I'm very happy for that. Very good. Yeah. So if people are looking for something that's just unique, um, you know, somewhat original, something that they're not going to see in anybody else's house or even in a catalog, right. this is really where they want to come. Yes. Yes. No, we don't have things from a catalog. No. Not too much. We ha and we have like really long pieces that you can use like over your sliding glass doors and I mean just, and we make shelves out of them or you can do it yourself. I mean I have a lot of guys that love to come here and they spend hours back there and they like to look around and all. We do, one thing I have to say though is we do have old wood and I have reclaimed lumber but I don't sell it because I, it's so hard for me to get it and we use it all. Right. So I apologize to people. I'll tell you where you can go get some if you want it, but I I can't, and I don't have a place where you can go through it and really look through it either. So right. it just it doesn't work, unfortunately. <laughs> but we have it; we can do it for you. Yeah, right. Well, we've made kitchen tops out of old heart pine for people's islands that they already have. We've done that. I mean, do you think of it? We can pretty much do about anything. So this is really just a must-see. It's a must-see in downtown Leesburg. We talked about you were here. How many years? You said 17? 17. 17 years. Uh, it's going to be, you're, you'll just really be impressed no matter who comes in. Right. Here. So. And we have a good sales staff. We have design assistance available. Um, I can help you design a piece of furniture. Jason can help you. Sean's here. She can help as well. We also have decorate. If you bring a picture like of a wall and say, I want to do something and I don't know what to do, we can help you with that. Or if you have an idea, I had a lady in today and she needed something to go over a window in her kitchen and she's working with a decorator and she was thinking she, well, she found a piece of ceiling tin she absolutely loved and we're going to frame it for her. So yeah. We so even littler things? Oh, small things, yes. Accents for the house? Yes. Yesterday I took those. a special order for a frame for a picture that um, I had that the girl liked. and It's just a print, but she needed this the length and I found it and so we're making a old frame out of old painted, it's old lumber, but mm -hmm. it's got paint on it so it's going to look old white paint and it's going to look really good. Very good. Yeah. yeah. Alright, well thank you so much. Oh, you're so welcome. And I'm going to Turn this back around. Thank you so much for tuning in to our Live in the 352 at Victoria's Antique Warehouse. I just have to say, you really have to come down and just check it out because it really, um, they've got so many great things. Every single corner, there's something else that's neat and exciting to see. Uh, if you have not yet figured out a way that you can be a part of our teacher appreciation breakfast, I encourage you to uh, talk to myself or Danielle and figure out a way, whether it's a door prize, um, whether it's some type of a, a little sponsorship to get uh, some that we can use toward door prizes, any of that, we would love to have that. Um, stuff for your goodie bags, all of that would be welcome. Thank you, Vicki, for giving us a door prize. <laughs> <Our teacher appreciation. laughs> Absolutely. So we appreciate that as well, and we will see you next week.